The half kneeling clean and windmill press is a great exercise for stretching out. Now, I found that this is the absolute best exercise for me in terms of working the flexibility in through the torso. And as I've mentioned before, I've got really tight and contracted muscles on this side because of back surgery that I had. There's a lot of scar tissue back there. The muscles have tightened up. There's not a lot of give because of the scar tissue. I mean, there's like an inch or two inches of scar tissue going up and down my back across for like six inches. So I've got, I'm very limited in this movement. But this exercise I found is amazing for helping me to stretch it out as well as train it for strength, okay? So start off half kneeling clean, right foot's flat on the ground, left or right hand is on the kettlebell, okay? Clean it up, nice soft landing. And here, I'm gonna drop my opposite hand to the ground. Once I'm on the ground, then I'm gonna press. Keep the bell overhead as I come back up off the ground, and then lower, and then you repeat, okay? So let's go step by step. Step one, clean it. Step two, hand to the ground. Step three, press. Step four, get up tall, keeping the arm overhead. Step five, lower the bell down to the shoulder, and start again. Okay, so that's the half kneeling clean and windmill press. Amazing exercise, trains the body in a totally different movement pattern and plane of motion than we're, that we're used to, as well as training a lot of different things that with the kettlebell that we don't normally get with dumbbells or barbells or different pieces of equipment, okay? This one, do it a little slower. What you really have to do is control that motion down. When you've got the bell here, you don't just drop down to the ground. You might throw at your back or something, something nasty. Make sure your hips are open wide. Control down under, nice and slow. Get that hand planted and then press. From there, up and repeat. Okay, half kneeling clean and windmill press.